hello. Let's turn on the light. There we go. What's up, guys? I think we're going to have a good stream today. Hold on. Let's see. Looks good. I think we're going to have a good stream today. Good to see you. Hey, Alsor, staying busy, my man. Mining, I see. Unanchoring, I see. Moving, we see, huh? Busy, busy. You, sir, are a real miner. I can give you that. Good to see you again, Sam. Hey, Scott. Good to see you guys. It's fantastic. I do miss not being on Twitch. I'm trying this out today. Twitch really helps with, um, um, Twitch helps with getting more people to the YouTube channel, and the YouTube channel helps people to get to the Twitch channel. Um, but I really want alerts to work, <laughs> and it's it's been hard to get alerts to work through um, Restream, which is the platform I use. Um, and I can't even say that I've gotten alerts to work yet. Um, so far, the only alert I have is the subscriber alert, and I'm trying to get this latest subscriber thing to work as well. I can fudge it with um, like um, a restream thing, but um, I'm yet to kind of see like a real one pop up. It could also be because I'm not that popular and people aren't subscribing left and right or whatever. But I can kind of fudge it, I think. Um, I can make an artificial alert pop up, but um, that's kind of it. But it's good to see everyone. I remember Demon Chicken. Good to see you, man. Thanks so much for, for stopping by. Um, even I still can't believe I'm streaming. Um, <laughs> to be honest, even I can't believe I'm still streaming myself so um, take that for what you will you know El Sor has subscribed see I got the phone notification but I don't have the YouTube notification for some reason even though it's I set it up the same way like the video tells me how to do it um, so I don't know I don't know. So, I can fudge it cut like this. Let me see if it'll work. Let me see if it'll work. Yeah, see? You see that Christina? That's me fudging it right there. And my sub count is fudged as well because it's a fake notification. Um... But I'm still learning. I mean, I've been, for somebody who's been streaming for as long as I have, like a year, two years, three years, on and off, I should really know this stuff, but I don't. I can build a spreadsheet, but for some reason I can't get my stream alerts to work. <laughs> uh, I didn't know they were mutually exclusive. So... As you can see also, my sub count is fudged now because of that alert. Let me see if I can reset it back. Don't worry guys, I'll get to, um, I'll get to some shipbuilding here in a second. Let's see, session data in. Okay. There it goes. All right, so I got that back. YouTube says four years. Heh, yeah. Really. I should be further along. Maybe I should just quit. <laughs> oh, man. 
Really, maybe I should just quit. Right? Maybe I should just quit. <sighs> but, here we go. Let's go to half and half here. And then let's bring this up. Okay. We do have some business to attend to here. Um, we've got some, we've got uh, four 812 ships to turn in, some invention to log, some reactions to set and collect and set. So I'll start with the reactions. No quitting now. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I should just win Eve and uh, go about go about with life, eh? Let's see. Vanadium for one, one, one. Okay. So these are done. Okay, that's done. And carbonite, titanium, sorry, titanium carbide's done. 21 runs of that is done. And ceramic fibers is done. And plasmonic metal materials is done as well. I mean, I've tried not to play Eve, but then um, I get an idea that I, of something I want to do in the game, and I'm like, oh no. <laughs> like, I'm like, well, you know, I really want to do this. And then um, I get some ideas, and then um, I end up coming back. So, yeah. Okay, so we've got some titanium stuff to, we've got, we got reactions in. Uh, let's finish this breacher here. Um, three out of five, so I'll take that. Great. Let's finish um, purifiers, maledictions, and anathemas. That's sweet. We gotta take those today. Um, and I think... Oh, and this oscillator. Oscillating capacitor unit as well. Okay, so. I turned in, um... Where's the purifier? I turned in a purifier. Uh, I don't have it logged, but I have these two logged. That's fine. We got malediction. We've got anathemas. Anathemas. Prospects. No prospects. Prospects all the way. So I should have. Oh, and I have a nemesis on the way. Need to make sure that's there. Okay. So we got nemesis, nemesi. How much uh, plex am I going for, Armando? Um... I'm not I'm not going for any plex. I'm just trying to have fun. But I did some math yes last night and um I'm right now I'm my project is um 2.5 billion um isk in isk in ships. Um <laughs> 
it does. Um, I'm um, spending um, right now. I'm constructing about two two and a half billion in ships, and I think I've invested about one point five billion in ships. Um, so after taxes, maybe. Uh, I don't know, 700, 800 million in profit working on that right now. Um, it's all scalable as well. Let's see. So as time goes on, it'll it'll keep going. Um, it should it should get better over time. So there's that. So. I just have to I have to sit down and really focus on what I want and, and make it happen because I'm really good at being distracted so I don't want to do that so prospect nemesis purifier purifier so we should be good there let me turn in um, this oscillating unit thing here looks like I already turned it on here so I can show you I can kind of show you this here as well. So right now, um, what is up with these ads? Right now I have um, copy, not copy. Right now I have, right now I'm working on, I think all of this maybe. And this should be the value of the stuff I'm, of just the components I'm working on. So there's also these up here. Actually, I think all of these go into what I'm making. Let's see. Yeah, so in components, it's about one, one and a half almost. In ships, I should have more, um, but we'll see. In ships, I should have more. And this equals that times that. Oh, the music died. Where's the music coming from? Uh, don't know. Oh, wherever it's coming from, it's back. I think this is the correct chips I'm making, but I'm not sure. Close this times that. I mean, granted, some of these already went to the market as well. So let me see if um, Eve Prazel will pick these up. Uh, right now it says 2.3 2 bill. So maybe I misspoke. But we're working on all of these. Um, yeah, two Falcons, one Bustard, eight Buzzards. A uh, few maledictions, a uh, couple nemes nemesi, I don't know. But all of these ships are on the way. Um, I don't see a crane. Yeah, never mind. There's the crane. Okay. So we're actually working on about 2.3 billion ships right now. Uh, 500 plex, I think, is like 2.5 bill right now. Don't quote me. I think that's where it's at though. So. So just the ships, just the, um, just the componentry we're working on is worth 1.4. 
and the ships we're working on is worth um, 2.3, which means that our um, advanced moon goo and stuff is worth even less than that, and then our raw moon goo even less than that. So it's a good investment. It takes time to get it all out, but it's it's all good investments for sure. So we're profitable. No worries. No worries there. Contracts tend to be 2.45. It, I think it does make more sense to to get Plex off of contracts. The, there's no taxes. That does make a lot of sense. Um, I do have a gate camp right now. So that's an issue. You think I can survive landing on this gate? Or nah. I got a Caracol and a Gnosis. What do y'all think? I'm in Tonga. You think I'll survive a landing on this gate? If I land at zero, then auto war auto jump. I don't think they can hit me, can they? I can like approach there um, and then I can maybe do this um, to work to zero and jump auto jump let's see let's see oh my god Oh snap! Look at these guys. Oh no. Okay, never mind. They're all they're all over there. But I do have some over here. Yes. It's out of Tama into Norvukaiken. And Norvukaiken is where I manufacture. So, I'm glad that I left my my bustard inside the system. <laughs> Very wise move. Very wise move. I like it. I'll take it. Hey, if you guys are brand new to the channel, please subscribe. Help me reach 1,000 subscribers. Maybe then CCP will make me a partner, eh? I can give away skins, do fun stuff like that, and uh, keep going. Keep growing. Not to mention, it's good for the EVE community, right? EVE is not just PvP, well, it is just PvP, but... Back into Tama is a bad idea. <laughs> I always scout before I go into Tama. Um, I even... I, ch I also sometimes check... Um, what's it called? Um, I also even check... Um, what's it called? The, the stream with the... Um, like with the gate camp watch I also I even watch those sometimes and then I'll grab a, a crow and I'll jump to the other side to see what's up and um, yeah alrighty okay let me see guys what I can build here um, 
definitely going to focus on components. So let's focus on components. Don't know if I have enough for all the components, but we'll see. I hope so. Sixty-nine, sixteen. All righty. Twenty hours here. Let's put this guy together. How about Chris, the line. Carbonite armor. 65.33. 19 hours as well. Tit uh, titanium iboride. 56.99. Wow, all of these are like 16 hours, tw uh, <laughs> 16, 20 hours. We'll see. Maybe it'll lower as we keep, as we go down the the list. Twenty three oh six nano um, mechanical. Seventeen. This one is a day and six hours. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. Sixty-one point six million in um, scalar capacitor units. Sweet. Uh, 20, yeah. Let's build Electro out guys here we got to switch characters <laughs> we're officially building too much uh it's a good feeling though like i'm i really it's i really can't believe i'm going to i'm finally going to like mass produce ships I've, it's been one of my eve dreams for a long time to just sit out sit and like pump out ships sit and pump out ships you know what i mean that would be sweet. Let's see if this is possible. Electrolytic capacitor unit. I got that's in. Okay. There we go. Um, oscillator capacitor unit. I just put together this oscillator unit. So do I need this oscillator unit? And um, 
Why don't I have enough fullerides? Like the last time, like I remember when I finally, um, when I finally mined enough to build my first orca, I was so excited that I bought a skin for it. <laughs> I was, I loved that orca. I really did. So, linear shield emitter. is next. sure where I am with these um, the oscillator capacitor unit I know um, I know right now I'm short I sacrificed the orca and got a nice oh um, and thanks uh, mini appreciate that So I really, really am low on fullerites. Okay. Um, they are nowhere to be found. So. Um, I'm tr I'm, I wonder, did I unload all my fullerites from my ship? My other ship? Maybe I forgot. I really loved my Orca, man. That for me was the best ship ever. When I finally went to the, when I finally went to the to the mining belt with that with that Orca, I I was like, yes, man. Yes, finally. Yep, I did put it in here, so. Oh. It's personal, so it's not in my corpse stuff. So I really am out of um, fullerides. And I need fullerides to build these this oscillator capacitor unit, but I'm not sure if that's true right now because I just built I just put one together here. So I'm trying to see like, okay, where why did I build this if 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 I needed this? So I'll try to build what I can right now, and. Um, uh, We'll see what we can do without building the, that extra fullerides. And if I have to build more fullerides, then I have to um, build build more fullerides. But if I'm short a thousand fullerides or whatever, I'm just gonna like probably get it from the market. Like I don't want to hold up production for for three days. Uh, 
because of some full rides, you know. It's really small when you in the in the grand scale. In the grand scale of what I'm trying to do, it's really small. So, what's an extra five mil, two mil here to to get production going? There's the scalar capacitor unit that I need right there. What is going on? I thought I just put that together. No, I put together the oscillator. Oscillating um, unit. Oh, this is why the 1723 that I've got on the way, the 17, uh, 1700, 200, 17, 1723 is going to eventually give me the ability to build these bu buzzards. So if I can't build these buzzards yet, that's why. And I've got scalar cap units on the way. Um, so yeah, let's see what I can build. I'm gonna go down the list and see what I can build. Some, I probably won't be able to build some stuff or everything, but I think I may be able to build some stuff. So I'm just gonna go down the list and see. Nope, not that. Okay. Okay, this stuff is on the way. That's fine. Um. That's on the way, Harpy. Look at all these Harpy blueprints I have. That's on the way. Yes, the oscillating oscillator of awesomeness gets in the way a lot. <laughs> uh, Helios. Yep, I really need my Galente stuff to finish. I also need um, my... The do nothing machine? What's up with Twitch? I meant to ask. Well, I'm trying to get my notifications to work. Hey, look, my latest subscriber works. I'll take that uh, twitch is hard to get I want a fun stream that um, that has all the the pop-ups and the you know um, if I was streaming from like restream I haven't been able to get notifications to work. Um, so, if I can get notifications to work on YouTube, I might have to just stick with YouTube. Or if I find out a way to make notifications work, or sorry, stream alerts is what I mean. If I find a stream, I don't know how long it took, I just noticed it. Um, so let me center your name a little bit. That's not fully centered. Where is it? Sub. Maybe I should just leave it alone. There it is. Anyway, I'll leave it alone. Um, I don't know how long it took, but I want the the so and so just uh, subscribed. Do you know why? Because I put up a really cool sound. 
you know what sound it makes when somebody subscribes on YouTube? It makes the job, you know, the sound Eve makes when somebody starts a job that I put that on there, right? So that's what I want. <laughs> I want it to work. For some reason, it's harder to make it work on YouTube, right? Like the Twitch notification always works. Like always works, looks like. So like even if I'm doing like a double stream, when somebody subs to you on Twitch, I'll get the notification. But for some reason, YouTube is like, no, you can't do that. At least in my experience, I could be totally wrong and I could just be like, hey, you know, a dum dum, which is, you know, very possible, you know? Um, so it's like, uh, so I want the little sound, like when somebody subscribes, it should go like, Shh. it should give me a pop up and then it should make the sound that I want it to make. I found that it's easier with Twitch though. For some reason, um, sometimes I, f I feel as though YouTube will skip a notification or something. That's what I feel and it's not based off of any fact. So far. Oh, I have a Jaguar. Yep, just waiting for that stuff to finish. Um, Manticore. More purifiers. <laughs> For some reason, I, I can build a purifier. I can build four purifiers if I want. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Like, for some reason, the purifier is like my, my golden child. Like, it'll just work. Hey, golden child, Omar, that makes sense. Um, I just need to get the Inquisitor. So, yeah, but the Twitch streaming platform I work I think works better. But I like I like YouTube more than Twitch, but I know that the the Twitch is better for streaming. So, you know, do I make more edited content, or do I stream more because they both take up my time, right? So, like, look at my hands. You see that? You know what this is on like this dark stuff in my hands. Like, I was laying hardwood floors today. Like, that's, that's my job. Like, um, um, I labor all day, right? So, I don't have infinite time to go to do to do a bunch of stuff. Um, recently, I have because it's been slow. <laughs> it's been rather slow. So, you know. So today was a messy glue day, kind of sucked. Where was I, purifier? I'm sure I cannot build a, a kitsune. I think we had this conversation before about the kitsune. Yep, so only purifiers. Purifiers or crusaders, I think. I have not built crusaders yet, but if I look at the profit, crusader, crusader. Well, never mind. They're decent enough profit, so. Yeah, I don't need these Inquisitors either. Go away. Bye. Okay. All right, so I already have um, eight purifiers on the way. Should I, should I build eight more? 
purifiers? I feel like that's too many purifiers. I, I can build, that. I can definitely build eight more purifiers if I want, but I feel like it's too many. Um, so I may not build more purifiers. Let me log back into the other character and we can get some of this stuff over. Um, get some, some of our stuff back over. So. I miss hitbox. What's hitbox? Vengeance and why am I not building it? Oh, that's why. Because there's no profit in them. Yeah. Well, you know, when things are free, your attention is like the product. So, people will go where they have the most fun watching people and. A lot of this stuff has like a, um, what's it called? Like a point of no return. What's the point of no return on a, uh, they kind of have like an event horizon or escape velocity where they don't depend on other platforms anymore, right? So there's that. So YouTube doesn't depend on anything else. Like a lot of these other places, I'm not sure, but they may depend like on other stuff to survive. I'm gonna take this, no I'm not. I'm gonna sell my tech uh, two ships. take this stuff over to uh, Amar and we'll, we'll look at our profits here. We'll look at our profits, see how they're going to do, um, see what we're going to list them for and so on. After being sold to Azubu and became smash cast. Okay. Um, Last it for a year. Yeah. Is are esports still big? Like I'll occasionally watch a StarCraft match, but I, I cannot label myself like an esports fan. You know? Are esports still like a thing? Are, are they still popping off? Is is like Counter Strike and Overwatch and whatever. Are they still like, like the bomb? I feel like esports is dying, but that's not. That just may be because I'm not paying attention to it. Like it may be dead to me. That doesn't mean it's dead. So. I mean, if StarCraft cannot survive in Korea, it can't survive anywhere. <laughs> Like, I feel like StarCraft is dying, but, you know, it'll survive in Korea. Like, StarCraft 1 survived in Korea. So, take that for what you will. Like, as a Brazilian, I can say, if I have to watch a soccer match, if I have to pick between, like, watching a soccer match or, or watching a game of, like, 
StarCraft, I'd rather watch the StarCraft. <laughs> uh, so there you go. I mean, somebody who's particularly good at a, at a, particularly somebody who's a good, who is a good entertainer, like, can, can play any game you know, on Twitch and, and do well, right? Somebody who's a good entertainer. Um, but, you know, a lot of people who's like brand, revolves around one game if that game dies their 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 channel's dead like really like none of you guys come here f to watch me play any other game right so like if eve if eve is dead i'm dead too <laughs> unless i start uh streaming kerbal kerbal space program 2 right right guys kerbal space program 2 that's coming out but I, I don't even think my computer can run it. <laughs> so, yeah. Or Factorio. Oh, I love Factorio, man. <sighs> like, I think if there was one game I could play for the rest of my life, it would have to be Factorio or Eve, I think. You know, Duncan McCloud. Thanks so much for the for the subscription, Duncan. Appreciate you. And this is where we should be getting the the, the notification. And it doesn't work for some reason. I don't know what's up. Closest game that I can find to Eve is Prosperous Universe. Mm. Isn't that the game Marky Dragon plays a bunch uh, next to Eve? Funny thing about Marky Dragon is he's 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 made a living playing games that nobody else really wants to play, except for like Eve or Prosperous Universe. Wait, is it Dual Universe? I think it was. All the no. <laughs> I feel like he he just. He plays games nobody else plays, and somehow he he, he made he made a living. <laughs> made a living from it. So, yeah, he knows. I bet he knows some stuff. Rain, rain, re rock. Hey, welcome. Let's see, item hanger. All right, boys, let's sell uh, 12 ships. Okay, let's check out our profits. Let's see where we're, where we're at here. And I can kind of just um, hide here and zoom in. So we're looking at the green, at the green ones. This is what we have um, over here. We have the four anathemas. Uh, the crows are already sold. We have the maledictions um, and purifiers. So we are a double purifier here, actually. So we can actually do this. Thank you. 
I did get into it, yes. Quite happy. Quite happy with it. All right, so boys um, or girl. Um, let's see what we can sell these guys for. My pricing has aged, has aged on like my market price, my unit market price, but it should be decently close. Let's see. Let's take a look at our Nathema first. Actually, purifier. Let's start top down. Okay, so the purifier is going for twenty one point eight million. My purifier, I've I've made for fifteen point five a piece. So I have fifteen point five uh, mil per purifier. They're going for twenty one point eight five over here. So estimated profit on the purifiers is 43 million right now. I'll take that, it's not bad. I can sell it to my, <laughs> how about this? My, my purifier prices are so good that um, I would be profitable if I sold them straight to the buy order. That's how good my purifier prices are. I, would st I could sell to the buy order and still make money. I'm not sure about the malediction, let's see. Oh, these are done. Um, maledictions, we've put together four, uh, 13.6 a piece maledictions, and they're going for 19.2. We've got four maledictions, so estimated profit 17. Point 17 million, let's just do 17 million. So, not bad, not bad. Yeah, they're looking good. I'm really happy about this, about uh, these profits. Okay, let's check out the anathema. All right, so the anathema cost me 14.1 million they're going for 18.46 i've got four anathemas so we are at estimated 14.7 million estimated on the anathema change the anathema did I or purifier I changed the anathema who me go back I didn't sell anything I didn't sell anything yet so whatever mistake I made can be fixed oh please check Addiction, yeah. Oh, you're right. Look at that. Let's see. Well, don't sell it yet. Okay. You're right. Yep, I did change the wrong price. My B. 19,200. All right. Let's go back to Purifier. Your fire is good. Maledictions good. And um, that's good. All right. We're all set. We're all set. All good? Am I good? I'm scared to sell now. Uh, let me know what you think. <laughs> Am I good? Am I good? I think I'm good. So 21.8 here, good. Um, oh, why is this 10 mil? That's really bad. Jeez, no brain today. Okay, bad again, all right. 19.17, that's fine, 21.8. This guy. 
this guy is. No wonder I can't make money. <laughs> oh man. No wonder. All right. All right, let's. <laughs> Magic 8 Ball said yes? Okay. It lied. Yeah, it did. Let me update my wallet real quick. So the most recent wallet entry is um, on the 20th, 2311. Go there to here. Hey, I hauled to Amar and forgot my cargo. You're not dealing with... <laughs> that sucks. <laughs> it happens to the best of us. I've left station many, many, many times with, without taking my stuff. You know? What can you do? Honestly, what can you do? That I would... I would probably <laughs> turn off the game if I... If I did like 30 jumps and realized my cargo stayed, I would be, I'd just be like, nope, I'm not a space trucker. Um, let me check out how we're doing on the ships that we have sold already. So we've sold... I don't have it. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I haven't made that yet, so never mind. All I have are Tech One chips stuff. That's fine. I'm not gonna make that now. Okay. What do I need to build those oscillators? Because I'm probably just gonna take it. Seventy oscillators. Yeah, that's fine. I'll just buy this. By missing. some full rides we need um what else do i need what is it that i need i'm not sure Maybe more inquisitors to build more purifiers or I could wait for the crusader to finish um, oh I need to install the crusader um, unless I already did Or Sentinel, never mind. So do I switch the Crusader for a Sentinel? Let's see. Welcome to the trading hub. We know there have been reports of scammers in the local area. The Crusader comes from the Executioner. Okay. Let me see if I can research that. Executioner. Okay. So I need the stuff to... Um, 
to research the Crusader. That's fine. Anything else? Oh, I want to work on, um, is it the Impel? You know what? Never mind. Transport ships are really hard to transport. So, how are um, Ish Ishtar's doing? I have an Ishtar blueprint from like a year ago. Let me see if I can price it out. Ishtar. I have an old Ishtar blueprint on hide. Good. They're doing good. Ishtars are doing good. Are you telling me? Wait. Wait, wait, wait. This much, this much, this much, this much. Are you telling me I can make 50 million on an Ishtar right now with my prices? Bro. Um, we're gonna go. <laughs> We're gonna go pick up our Ishtar blueprint, okay? And we're going to check this out. Because it turns out the Ishtar is legit. Right? So if the Ishtar is legit, then that means we need Vexers. Like yesterday. We need. Um. If a, if a transport can transport transports, you can transport two. <laughs> the answer the answer to that is 11t2 buy or build a bowhead uh check prices I don't have I don't have those okay let's buy two I have an old blueprint to pick up now because that, that Vexer is calling my name or the Ishtar is calling my name. Let go. I want a bowhead too, but isn't it just to transport like um, assembled ships? Can, can a bowhead transport unassembled ships? I don't think it can. You know what I really need? A Providence is what I need. gonna need a providence soon providence 3.1 bill uh maybe not so soon hey <laughs> maybe not so soon i can pilot one raiders are better at it uh, okay gotcha i can pilot a providence they're selling for 3.1 bill. I don't know what's the profitability on building one. So, okay, I have a, um, first I have a Ishtar blueprint to pick up. Right, look at that. Look, I already own some of these. Uh, this was me like a year, two years ago or a year ago with these Ishtar blueprints. Guys, I have 12 runs on this Ishtar. And it's in the same system. 
And I have a Courser already. And I have a Sigil already. Oh, fantastic. It's a nice little piggy bank I left a year ago. Take that. Did anyone else notice the Pillars of Creation um, nebula here in Jita? It's the Pillars of Creation nebula right there. And I think, I think it's part of like the Eagle Galaxy, not Galaxy, a nebula. Yes. It's the how it's how Eve goes sometimes. You need this to do that, but you also need it to do the opposite, the reverse. Ah, nice. Oh, look, the pillars of creation. Nebula. Which I think is part of like the eagle or the horse head, I don't remember. Time for a Google. Oh, did you guys see the new Pillars of Creation um, uh, photos from James Webb? were like blue greenish it's sweet and you can see like the little octagonal flares that's from the mirrors of the James Webb sorry hexagonal I think Tell you that isn't the Eagle Nebula. Okay, Pillars of Creations are the Eagle Neb are the Eagle Nebula. Um, I've been there. I can attest. Where is there, Moin? Where have you been? You mean Jita? I mean, I could be wrong. I'm not a telescope guy or an astrophotography guy or uh, or astrophysicist or anything like that. I've never looked through a real telescope, so I could be wrong. I don't mind being wrong. They look really similar, though. I'm not going to lie. I think you can see the inspiration. If it's not, you can see the inspiration. boys to pick up look at that it's tar how much is this worth six million per run 
and do Dixie. And Jita, six million per run. So I've got four runs. Oh, but it's a 7%. I don't know, I think I could sell this for 15, 15, and 15 there. Probably, but it's whatever. Looking, looking through a telescope at a comet or a Saturn is dangerous. I mean, it's something I've always wanted to do. I love, sp I love, I really love space. Like, I was, um, like, I've always liked like the space documentaries and stuff like that. And I, um, I was holding back tears when I saw the SLS finally go back to the moon. I was like, yes, I was so happy. I watched the SLS launch uh, live, not there, but as it happened on my phone. I remember because I was at work. I'll never forget watching the SLS um, launch because where I, where I live, it was like three in the morning. And I was doing a night job that day. I was laying floor at an old people's home. Um, and my phone dinged and it was time to watch the SLS, SLS launch. And I was holding back tears. I was so happy to see the SLS um, launch. Definitely. Karsten, welcome. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. I wish my dinger alert would work. If it was Twitch, it would work. Ooh, Canada. We'll have to plan on it someday. I think, have you seen the astrophotography people? That, like the backyard astrophotography guy who takes the, the photos of the nebulas and stuff like that. Oh, it's amazing. Like, I get hooked on it. Easily. Easily hooked. Easily hooked. Okay, guys. The Vexer threw a wrench. <laughs> threw a wrench in my plans. Um, I want to build that Vexer really bad. Not Vexer, um, Ishtar. So these will go into blueprints. This will go into blueprints. This will go into building materials. This into building materials. This into blueprints. Okay. What do I need to build uh, the Ishtars? Five days. Oh, I need a lot. <laughs> I need a lot to build the Ishtars. Oh man, just there. About 690 million in in components alone. Yeah, can't build the Ishtars. I had a hope I could build one Ishtar. <laughs> I can build one Ishtar pretty soon. If I can build one Ishtar, I can build two. We get into we run into issues when we get well. Who knows? because I've got all of this stuff coming out. So, um, I've got all this stuff coming out pretty soon. So, we will do an Ishtar project soon, soon. So, the next goal is gonna be the Ishtars. So, I can go ahead and show you how I plan for that. 
So I'm going to plan for that. So, um, oh, let me build this oscillator first. another character is what I'm trying to say okay so we're going to uh, head over to Taku and uh, pop in those oscillators you max all out for building Empire for building and Empire's awesome you max out skills all five for building and empires. What do you mean by empires? I'm sorry. Seventeen twenty-eight and oh. okay. so this guy's good. Um. Okay, so we're going to, these I'm not gonna, I'm gonna unready these here. Actually, I don't have to, I'm just gonna, wait, do I not have the Vexer in the thing? Oh, if I don't, I'm gonna have to throw it in. So I have this planning thing here that I just throw in the ship that I need. Um, and it should pop out whatever I need. So Ishtar, Ishtar, Ishtar. I just have an Ish curve. All right. Here we go. Ishtar. And. Okay, I need to do a little bit of work on the spreadsheet to get it to pump out. Um, right now, I'm working on my science skills on my second character. Yes, I try to max those out. The science skills help you uh, with research or invention, as it's called. Um, so product ID, let's go ahead and grab the product ID for the Ishtar. something to, in order to build it not that I know of there's a lot of ships I build that I can't pilot like all of those t2 frigates I can't pilot all of them and if I can't well, well, well just it's just one more skill so there's that as well So we're going to 0.97 this. All right, so what I'm going to do is 
I have to add the Ishtar to um, to my calcul my calculator thing thingamajig here. Um, I'm gonna take a quick break. My wife got home. I'm gonna go give her a kiss, uh, get something to drink, and I'll be back in the one minute. Don't leave. And if you're here, you're not subscribed. Please subscribe. Look at that. We're about to hit 850. Thank you. I'll be right back. I'm back. So, I want to add 
the Ishtar to this real quick, and then this will be the last thing I do uh, today. So let me just add the Ishtar to um, my math, my math, my bobber, <laughs> my math thing, and then we'll see where that goes. Wait, I already have the Ishtar in my math thing because it's doing math. So never mind, my Ishtar is already in the math thing. Um, so that's good. I just don't have, wait, 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 wait. Let's see. Let's see if the Ishtar changes my math stuff here. Okay, so. As I pick this, I should be able to do this. And it changes nothing on this one here. Which I was thinking it should. Because I think everything else does change it. No. Okay. What am I missing here? One run, or four runs, one blueprint. Okay, the Falcon goes. And the one run, four blueprints. Okay. So something is reading that is um, opposite. That's not going on. So I think that maybe I don't have it here. So let me throw the Ishtar in here. So BP ID is what I need. So we'll throw it in there. So Ishtar. Whoa. BPE, BPID, okay. Okay, I already have this. So this one works a little different from the other stuff. info dumped into general chat of EOC some details about astronomy societies oh cool astronomy is neat I like astronomy thank you so what I'm doing right now is I'm just adding the Ishtar into the maths of everything um, for some reason I, I didn't have it so I'm just adding it into the math of stuff So I have this math table here that that does all the, the calculations. This is for every T2 ship that I have here. This one would be for the Falcon right there. This four. So this um, this here would be the Falcon line. And then down here would be the Ishtar line. So all I have to do really is um, not even that. Just copy this and paste it because that's how I set it up to be able to get fixed. Like that. And there's my Ishtar line right there. So let's do that. So I see my Ishtar line there and now I can kind of check it. Nothing yet. And why? Let's see. So I've got all of this here. It probably has to do with it not reading what I need correctly. So I'll go to here. 
and probably add a few more lines to it. Let's do 185. There it is. There it is. All right, now we can kind of test it. Hey guys, um, EOC is um, 850. Thank you. See, I went, this is why I need the alert. Thank you so much. 850. Um, EOC is recruiting. EOC is recruiting, by the way. Engine of creation is recruiting. Okay, so now I can take a look at um, filter by color green. Ishtar four. Okay, so this is kind of like how the logic, how it's supposed to be. I think if I look, this is me checking to see if it works. So let me grab just Ishtar here so you can see how this is how sometimes how I want it to work. I have like two ways of making this work, but this is like one of the ways right there. Um clear this this is what I want okay so if I zoom in here right there zoom into this you can see my crystalline uh, carbonite armor right there um, and it says I need um, 21608 a crystalline carbonite armor plates and if I look here it says I need 21608 carbonite armor plates so this is how I check my math for it 1729 um, on the oscillator cap unit oh um, it's wrong here 1732 1729 why let's Let's check our thing here. Point nine seven is correct. So this is off by a number. I don't know which number. I have a three percent roll bonus, or sorry, three percent um, thing here. One sec, guys. I have to take this call. I'll be right back. Do you use a matrix to show the compounds of, of the buildings? Yes. Um, the same thing I used to grab the info for the ship, I, I used to grab for the components, if that's what you're asking. Um, so Ishtar.970 here. So there is a percentage block that's off. 2108, 21607. Here. So it's very, very close. I think this might be um, um, uh, are we in the matrix? I'm joking. Um, probably not.
Let me see the math here. I have a blueprint efficiency thing there times production at five O. So here I also have this thing here. My number is off, but by only a little. And I think I think it's a structure roll bonus. I have for some reason, my structure row bonus is point. Um, is this going to change anything for me? I'm not sure where this structure row bonus lands over here. Um, oh, I can assure you. <laughs> It did, they did not go away when I was in high school in 2013. So don't worry. There's the jokes are the bad jokes are still there. Uh, calculator, calculator. Why are you off? Why are you off? Somewhere in my math. Here. Okay. V, look up that. This times that is here. That times that times that. So a column. Yeah, I have my B and C column here, which is right. Times I don't know why this is wrong. I really don't. I may have to end the stream without figuring out the problem. But I've got a 1% row bonus, which is reflected here. I don't know why I have two uh, bonuses there. I'm trying to figure that one out still. Um, but, but, I know it's mostly correct. I think it might be because I'm dealing with bigger numbers and something might be off just by a smidge. Okay, I'm gonna take one shot at it, and if it doesn't work, I'll control Z, but this is the last thing I do here on the stream, okay? So, V look up that there, okay? So, what I have to change is in here somewhere. If there is a change. Okay.
the run there. The amount of runs I ordered. I'll go back. The amount of runs I ordered. Dang it. There. B, B, okay. The amount of runs I ordered times the blueprint efficiency. There. Times. The 1% thing there. That'll add up to whatever that is. Then, um, I'm thinking out loud. That multiplies into, whoa. Well, okay. That just burned itself. don't know why the Ishtar is the one that because I thought everything else was working okay oh I found I found I found a problem okay it's not the math it's that I ordered one blueprint four times and not four I ordered one run it with four different blueprints instead of four runs in one blueprint let's check the math now Actually, I can just look this up here. Okay, what do I need? I need Eve to be up and this to be here. All right, let's check out what we need. I need 1729 oscillators right there. 1729 oscillators. I need 1729 pulse shield emitters right there. And I need 21 uh, 608, um, 607, right there. All right, good. All right, it was just, uh, the problem was not the worksheet. It was, the problem was between the chair and the screen. But guys, I have to go. Thank you so much, as always. God bless. I'll see you very soon. EOC is recruiting. I'll, I am available in Discord if you need me. I can't promise I'll reply, but I'll eventually reply. So I'll see you guys very soon. Thank you so much. See ya.